Lily the Leopard Gecko Story by Jessica Sterling Malik Illustrations by Jason Friend Mummy, guess what? My school said I could bring Lily home for the summer. Who's Lily? asked Mummy. Lily the Lizard. Lily can ride bikes with me. Lily can come to the park with me. Lily can swim with me. Hmm, Mummy said. I don't think Lily can do all those things. Taking care of a pet is a lot of responsibility. I'm not sure this is a good idea. Please, Mummy. Please, Mummy, please. Okay, Mummy said. But first we should go to the library and learn more about lizards. I can't read, but Mummy can. So he checked out three books about lizards. I learned a lot more about Lily and how to take care of her. I learned that Lily is a leopard gecko. Lily is from this part of the world. That's really far from here. Lily has brown and black spots, dark eyes and holes for ears. Her fat tail is almost as long as the rest of her body. Be careful, don't pull her tail or it might fall off. But don't worry, it will grow back again. Lily is cold blooded, so she needs to live in a very warm environment. Lily is also nocturnal. That means she sleeps during the day and is awake during the night. I will watch over Lily during the day while she sleeps and Lily can watch over me at night while I sleep. Now that I'd learned all about leopard geckos, we went to my school to pick up Lily. We put Lily in the car. She rode in the back seat with me. Teacher Cheryl gave us a list of instructions to take care for Lily during the summer. Lily care instructions. Number one, Lily's tank must be heated. Number two, feed Lily live crickets every two days. Number three, fill Lily's water bowl every day. Number four, clean Lily's tank once a week. Next, we went to the pet store to buy live crickets for Lily to eat. The pet store worker said that we have to feed the crickets too. Crickets eat apples, carrots and potatoes. Finally, we took Lily home. We set up her tank in my bedroom. When I went to feed her crickets, they all jumped out of the box. There were crickets everywhere. Daddy was not happy when he found a live cricket in his bed that night. For the whole summer, I played with Lily, filled her water bowl and cleaned her tank. Lily grew big, fat and healthy. Lily was happy. Lily is my friend. Now summer is over and it's time to bring Lily back to school. I'm sad to see her go, but I'm happy to share her again with all my friends at school. I know I will miss her but I will get to see her every day. See you at school tomorrow, Lily.